an old Portuguese hamlet at Geonkali. Now you are watching the bust of Reverend Father Christia Mingo, who worked hard for the upliftment of the Christian families of Geonkali near River Hookley. Father Christia Mingo translated New Testament in Bengali and named it Mongol Bartha. This new Catholic church was built by the father in 1975. He came from Belgium. He was associated with St. Javier's College in Kolkata. He is still remembered by the Christian families of the Stini hamlet for his contribution towards them. Another Protestant church was built recently by Father Peter Thurman. In search of history, I came back to an old Portuguese hamlet at Geokhali, Mohishadal, in the district of East Mithnapur. Nearly 180 Portuguese families live here, out of which 120 families are Catholic Christian and 60 families are Protestant. We have to date back in the era of Rani Janoki Devi of Mohishadal Raj family. After the demise of Raja Anandalal Upadhyay, his wife Rani Janoki became the ruler in 1776. She was educated, efficient, and kind-hearted. For the welfare of her subjects, she did much for her subjects. But in those days, the invasion of the Borgi of Maratha created terror and panic in Bengal. The Borgis were plunderer, killer, and destroyer of wealth. Rani Janoki invited some Portuguese spirits of Goa and allowed them to settle at Geokhali, offering land free of tax. In exchange, the Portuguese had to fight against the Borgis when Rani called them. The armies of Rani were trained by these Portuguese. These Portuguese did not return to their native land. They settled here and married Bengali women. Here there is a blending of two cultures, Portuguese and Bengali. Those earlier Portuguese were influenced by the Bengali Kirtan and composed songs like Kirtan in praise of Christ. I am fortunate enough having heard such an old song. Now the occupations of this Portuguese family are agriculture, business, trading, service. But as Christian, they rigidly practice their religious Christian belief. In a nutshell, it is the history of some Portuguese spirits who spent their post-marital life having married with the Bengali woman.